What's happening, folks? Gerald here, aka Jeffrell90, coming at you with another reaction, bringing back to the channel the group LaBelle, but also bringing to the channel a legend, a bona fide legend named Cher. <laughs> Cher. Um, I like Cher. I, I like Cher a lot. Um, I have a Bones um, like outline understanding of her discography, uh, like, you know, deeper than the Beatles, deeper than, you know, a lot of other artists, it, it, deeper than Barbara too. Um, I know, I, it, I know of song, I know of share songs and hits from every decade. Basically I got the Sonny and Cher songs from the sixties as well. Solo share in the sixties. Um, uh, I know she's the originator of bang bang, which I love. Um, 70s i know gypsies tramps and thieves um half breed take me home that's that's actually one of my favorite uh share songs and then in the 80s that's shared big comeback and big you know that late 80s so i found someone um if i could turn back time 90s um, that nineties was my introduction this year because I'm a nineties kid, but, um, she, she took over and she came to the consciousness of me and all the kids I knew with, um, do you believe in love? And then I know songs from the 2000, 2010. So anyway, anyway, I'm familiar with Cher. Just, I don't have a deep understanding with her discography, but we're bringing her to the channel. And so we're going to, you know, be doing some Cher stuff. <laughs> so, and then I love that I get to use LaBelle to do it, that this is them together. Um, this song with LaBelle, I feel like I've heard before. It's a title I'm semi-familiar with. Uh, what can I do for you? Um, if I've heard it before, it was a long time. But it seems like a title that I like maybe having a playlist or two. But um, never heard it with Cher. Never seen them with Cher. Never seen Patty. La never seen Patty LaBelle and Cher together. So very curious to how this is going to go. Um, but before I get to the video, I need you guys to go ahead and subscribe and ring the bell for notifications. I'm excited because, you know, Patty and Cher both to are today still tour. I don't know. No, Cher's not touring. But they, they have very long career. They, they, they to the day releasing music and, and doing things and stuff. So, and I love that. I lo y'all, I love a legend. I love a legend. So, anyway, um. Without further ado, this is LaBelle and Cher with What Can I Do For You Live. Can we talk about Cher fits right in on that harmony? They are a four-part group right here. <laughs> they are in vogue right here. Cher fits right in. I hear all four of their voices, and they all sound fantastic. Man, we got to acknowledge that. We got to acknowledge that.
Jeez Louise. <laughs> that, you know what I appreciate in that though? Is um that got me hearing Sarah Dash in a whole different way. Um and rest in peace to Sarah Dash. Um I'm very familiar with Patty. I'm pretty familiar with Cher, <laughs> you know, I'm I'm more familiar with Cher, the image and the hair and the all that stuff, um, and the actress too, than the music per se. And then I'm I'm familiar with not all of Nona Hendrick, but Nona got this album from I think it's '86. I just it's Why Should I Cry? I think is the name of it. Um, I love <laughs> love that album. Um, but Sarah. I only relate. I I know the least about Sarah in when it comes to Labelle. It's it is funny. Even Cindy Bird's song has the Supremes. You know she had Labelle and the Supremes. But um, Sarah Dash, I just know of Labelle. And even then, vocally, I I've, I've heard her in certain songs. I know she has certain solo moments, but I never heard her like this though. And if I, I think on the recorded version, I probably would have thought that that was like Patty or something like that, doing all that holding of the notes and all, man, Sarah, Sarah. But then Patty always, she always read for that group that they were bad. They, and they were all three of them, all three of them bought something really special and really unique and really different to LaBelle. And, um. Yeah, Cher, and like, Cher fit right in there. Cher said, oh, Cindy's gone. I can be that fourth member. We can be Patty LaBelle and the Bluebells again. And so, yeah, Cher, Cher, Cher fit. That harmony is maybe my favorite part in that it was a perfect four-part harmony for my ears. That I, It was perfect. I, I loved it. I loved it. And it, it's funny. You guys might have saw one uh, headphone drop, but that's because the performance I saw, it was clearly an old YouTube one with, meant audio where only one ear worked <laughs> so it was like okay that one can fall i was just i was i was making it work with one so hopefully by the time this gets uploaded that i'll have a second one to replace the audio with that's more recent that's that share needs to release all the music from her share show <laughs> because i i'm gonna do the jacksons with her too um eventually but i think it's the jackson five actually but um because that um I know she has some really great musical moments on that show and like be great to hear them and see them in HD and all that. So anyway, anyway, um, more share recommendations in the comments. Um, I'm got shares going to be a part of the channel. <laughs> she, I don't know how regular, but she'll be coming along and I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. If you did, please go ahead and like subscribe, ring the bell for notifications. You want to follow me on my social media. That's in the description below. If you'd like to tip me sponsor request, just plain donate or check out my Amazon wish list. That's in the description too. My birthday is January the 27th. That'll be very helpful. And you can also check out my Patreon. Become a patron on the Patreon. On there, you're going to get benefits like early access to videos like these and Patreon only videos like these. And then lastly, just thank you all so much for even taking this time to push play on this here video today. It means so much to me and it goes such a long way. And beyond everything else, you all, please take care of yourselves and each other.